Hey yo, it's your boy OK Bet here bringing you another new world video. Today we're going to be doing the new Springtide Bloom in 40 seconds. If you want to stick around for all the info and some tricks, all that stuff, feel free. If not, there's the X button, you know what I'm saying? Uh, first, equip your food, guys. Do a little damage to these little wasps, you know, spin in some circles, do some things, plant some bombs, right? Just go in a circle, stay in the middle ring, don't go near the flower. Flower's bad. Remember, flower, bad, okay? Don't go in there. You plant three bombs to kill him. Tied him around in a circle. Boom. There. The event is now done. Pick up your bags. If you get some, go close the flower in the middle. There you go. Easy peasy. Now, I know you've enjoyed these uh, last 30 seconds. I don't hear that much, but make sure you guys like, subscribe, get notified, all that fun stuff, all the YouTuber lingo. And next, we'll go into what not to do during the Springtide Bloom event. Do not stand in the middle like these guys. It took them... I want to say probably 15 or 20 minutes just to close this. I'm only going to show you guys like a minute of it, but it's very frustrating, uh, especially when you have people just standing there doing nothing AFKing because the wasps will gather towards the center and not actually allow you to hit them with the bombs. So please don't be that person that's just rolling through the center while we're all trying to get this done fast and effectively. Now we're going to go into all the details about the Springtide Bloom event. You can travel to each city. You can go where they used to have the Christmas trees and all that stuff set up. You gather a gift package, which contain items that are useful for the event, such as the Wispy Spritz. Wispy Spritz are basically the bombs that you plant while you're trying to kill all the wasps. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to fast travel. I'm going to go to the Spring Tide Village and the top of Brightwood. If you don't have this unlocked yet, you can simply go to the shrine right to the right of it. Find yourself over there. Now that we've traveled to the Springtide Village, this is the place where you're going to be able to craft all of your spritz. You're going to be able to redeem all your tokens, do all that stuff. If you guys want to make the spritz, it's just fibers, honey, and fire motes. Now, each one of these that you craft is actually eight of the spritz. So that's important to know because some people have been crafting like 800 of them for no reason. Myself, uh, I usually do about three to 400 every time I go out. So usually will last me about three hours, roughly. So, you know, maybe a hundred an hour, something like that. But in the shop, you can actually buy food, which will increase the yield of the petals you get. And the petals you get, you can then redeem as tokens. You can also do the luck food, which I haven't found being as useful as the yield food. But whatever you feel works best for you is what you should do. Now I'm going to show you some quick ways just to cheese the event. You can simply just run up and close the spring bloom in the middle or the wispy bloom in the middle. We'll say thank you to Vilvi here for letting me do that just randomly. You know, jump and support. Yay. We support each other. Second way is actually a lot easier to do because you don't have to mess up the whole event to do it. You don't have to run in the middle and blah, 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 blah. Just let everybody else do all the work, waste all their bombs, do all the, you know, hard lifting and then all you really have to do is just plant a bomb before someone closes it in the middle and it's pretty simple and voila you get credit for the event and you did absolutely nothing thank you for contributing so much to society now in the next clips i'm going to show you guys the route that i run with my buddies we usually just go to the top of reek water um there's four or five of these events that you can run between Usually by the time you're done with the last one, you can then look back to the first one and keep going in a cycle. We get about 60 plus patterns an hour, which is great because I love crafting. I've crafted, I want to say 300 something of the event patterns already. We're on day three of the event. The cool thing about this right here is you can watch the double plant, which will save you a lot of time. So if you have some friends to run with, you all just spam E on the bomb site and Eventually, you'll get a double proc. Great. Saves time. Saves energy. The rest of this video is just waiting for the meme of New World to happen. My game actually crashes as soon as I get a bag for the the wispy wasp goo, which are great because you get one whole premium token by just getting one of the bags. If you guys like the way I'm doing this content by just giving you all the information up front and then explaining everything afterwards, uh, please leave a comment. Let me know. And... Whatever else you guys want to see about New World, let me know. I have about 6,200 hours in this game and a plethora of knowledge. So thank you for watching. I appreciate you guys and happy hunting.